and the Stones fans are gathered in a knot in one corner of the Jimmy Cyril stand and in fact there's only two stands open it's only the whole Pavia stand and the Jimmy Cyril stand Notts County obviously not expecting a vast crowd uh, but it is a vast ground um, so uh, we're just, uh, just just getting ready the mascots having their photographs taken uh, it's a beautiful balmy day in Nottingham a few clouds in the sky sun's going to be going down in an hour or so but uh, it is really nice and um, it's nice to see I mean you may have seen during the week that the, the Stones squad are smiling um, interesting to see Tom Hadler in goal uh, news that Dan Barden's actually injured and here we go back from Corn to Booty it's the same kickoff you always see Booty hits it right but it's headed on by Notts County and the ball is in the centre circle and it's with Bajrami Bajrami loses out ball's hit forward and the ball falls to Barham on the left Jack Barham on the left gets the ball opposite the back out to Galvin Galvin can only put it back to Jerome Binn and Williams Billin Williams sees Booty inside Booty rakes the ball to Sam Corn. Sam Corn gets into the box race it across the six yard box misses everybody Uh, anyway, Notts County come forward and the ball is right towards Mitchell, cut out by Ellel and uh, Galvin has it, but uh, Galvin loses out to Namani. No foul, even though Namani went over and the ball is inside with Corn now. Still inside the Maitstone half, back to Lawson. Lawson has the ball, gets it out to Regan Booty. Booty plays a long ball forward towards Barham, who is on side, and Barham is far in advance of the Notts County defence, comes into the box, across the six-yard box. Barham turns on to his right foot and hits it over. First chance of the game. 17 minutes on the clock and Jack Barham functioned out of nothing and just hits it over and a Maidstone player is down. Francis gets the ball back to Bajrami. And Bajrami back to Francis. Sorry, that was Matty Palmer, not Francis. My apologies. I will get used to these Notts County players before the end of the game. Anyway, that's definitely Rawlinson that hits the ball into a left wing position. Left winger runs at Deacon, but decides to play a pass inside. That's over everybody. Namani at the far post. Hits it into the side netting. And that's Notts County's first real chance. Yeah, he was just stretching for it there when he had that cross come over. He just stuck his foot out. And he just the angle wasn't good enough. He just went into the side netting. And Namani's now got some more space because Galvin trapped Bejrami and runs at Binham Williams. Binham Williams tackles, but Bejrami gets the ball. Headed on by Ellel and the ball is outside of the area will Fowler get to it before it goes out just hits it forward towards Barham and it's on the ground and Barham is, tries to establish possession loses out tries to foul his man referee says play on Notts County come forward streaking forward across along the left across the edge of the six yard box and headed over by Mitchell so that's two chances to one Notts County you look at their FA Trophy record Notts County and they have Competed in the competition three times, two semi-finals, one quarter-final. Inside to Corn, who's come back, back to Bowen. Bowen back to Hadler. Hadler hits a really, really long ball forward, and it's won by Cameron. Only as far as L, L to Deacon. Deacon back to Fowler. Fowler inside to L, back to Bowen. So nice passing and interplay by the Stones. As uh, Ellul streaks forward, he's over the halfway line. He's got Ben and Williams outside him. Ben and Williams plays Galvin in his run past him, and it's on the corner of the box. Galvin gets it across the area towards, and another chance. Pass bar and Sam Corn coming in on the edge of the six yard or the far part of the six yard box, doesn't quite get his foot on it, and uh, as expected, it's nil nil here. We've had. Um, 38 minutes, Notts County have been shading it, but uh, you know, there have been a couple of Stones attacks, uh, both Barham and Corn have had decent chances as the ball's played forward and uh, <laughs> Bajrami gets in in front of Barham there, oh and the ball falls to Barham Barham's on the edge of the area, he's pushed over that's a penalty to the Stones confusion in the Notts County defence, hello us at York last week, and it will be a Penalty, and will there be a red card? No, it's a yellow card for um, Mayor. I think nowadays what they do is if they give away a penalty, they don't tend to send people off. Yeah, yeah. 
So it will be a penalty and can the Stones score their first ever goal against Notts County at the third attempt? I've not counted any chickens yet. It's, it's, it's Booty with the ball on the spot and uh, it's taken his time. The referee says go and here he goes, Booty and he hits into the corner. That's 1-0 to Maidstone United. The first ever goal we've scored against Notts County at the third attempt. 200 and 250 minutes in, in, in plus added time into that and uh, the hundred or so Maidstone fans maybe a few more out there are in now in fine voice and that is a booty penalty to Francis Francis it's, it's, it, it's it out left inside under attention from Deacon the ball goes back to Baldwin, Baldwin tries to rake in the money he's in quite a bit of space here takes it on his chest, Ben and Williams is over Galvin behind him the ball is back to Bajrami. Bajrami gets it across the edge of the six-yard box. Header in. You could hear my voice raised as there was a Notts County header, but by the time I'd said it, it had already gone wide. And it's Hadler with the free kick for the offside. It's a long, long ball forward and runs back into his goal towards Deacon. Deacon doesn't win. And it's won by Cameron. It's inside towards Chickson. Chickson across. And the ball is played forward towards Palmer, making a lovely run. Nimani gets outside Ben and Williams and comes across. And uh, Chickson, uh, Nimani still with the ball across the edge of the six yard box and a little back shot. Um, <coughs> Notts County player went over in that attack, and there's um, a, a few words being said, but uh, I think any clash was accidental. These two have actually given him absolutely nothing all day. He's, he's, he's raked out a couple of chances, but uh, nothing to do with the ball being played up to him. And Stones had the ball with Corn. Corn back to Booty. Booty drives through two Notts County players, plays a 1 2 with Deacon, gets it back, but can, uh, is facing Hadler, and that's the only way he can go. Hadler out to Ellel on the edge of the area. Ellel out to Bone. Bone to Fowler, inside to Lawson. Lawson plays the first time ball forward towards Barham. And Barham, Mayer comes out and he's a long way out the area under tension from Barham. Deacon has got an open goal. He shoots, he shoots, it's in. Yeah! <laughs> it's 2 0. Mayer came a long way out. He was tackled by Jack Barham. The ball fell to Rory Deacon. And 59 minutes gone. You often see that and there's either a powder puff shot or it goes wide. And that just was uh, seconds before it happened, just sneaked into the corner and the Jimmy Cyril stand, well, part of it is erupting. Rory Deacon, Notts County nil, Maidstone United two. There's still football, Nigel, but... Wow. Well, yeah, you know, many not too happy returns to it. <laughs> uh, I dare say he's probably had victories on his birthday and let's hope he doesn't get one today. Um, there's still plenty of football. Notts County has still got plenty of um, validity in there as Baldwin comes forward. Gets the ball inside to Palmer off the edge of the box. Under attention for three mates, no play. Gets it. And that's again. Oh. Palmer got it. Hit it against the player. Ball runs across and Notts County have got one back. Through. I'm just trying to see. It uh, looks like Chickson just confirmed that. 63 minutes gone. Yes, it definitely is Chickson. So, uh, players in the line about 10 yards off, for, off, off, off the Knox County area. Uh, down by Barham. Barham as far as Lawson. Lawson doesn't manage to establish possession, but Deacon does. Uh, he's forced backwards, Deacon gets it outside to Fowler who's in advance with him, Fowler starts running forward, little ball inside to Lawson, Lawson tries a speculative shot that is not troubling anyone unfortunately, um, could have done, um, uh, but, uh, and again Mayer was on his line. Well interestingly um, Rory Deacon's going into right back and I've personally not, I mean my personal opinion, not been a fan of Rory Deacon playing at right back, but uh, anyway it's uh, going to be a straight swap. Jack Barham's coming off. Yeah, for Wally, for Barham. Um, have to say that is actually just a straight swap and Jack Barham has played really well. And uh, is Dom, Dom Adesanya is going to come on as well, but Lawson is actually down while they're making this substitution. Yeah, 15 just got a yellow card for Baldwin, just got a yellow card for 
Notts County. Yeah, and he's, he's back up and... Uh, yeah. Lawson's coming off there and... Uh, well, he, he was Adesanya's a player down on. and he'll be replaced by Dom Odesanya. So, just noting that one down, as Lawson is not... Uh, I mean, he's just been down injured, so if that was genuine and he's talking to Odesanya, the referee... The referee will add this on. I mean, uh, hoots from the Knox County fans, and uh, hopefully you didn't hear what one of them's just said. But um, anyway, based on with the ball. Then not even Premier League games were, were all filmed in those days. Um, so nobody knew. Anyway, the ball is out with Austin on the left. Hits it back towards Baldwin. Towards Rawlinson. Rawlinson hits it out towards Cissé. Cissé with the ball across towards Ellul. Ellul gets it out towards Binham Williams on the corner of the box. Binham Williams just strides through two Notts County players back towards um, Booty. But Booty hits it against Cissé. So Cissé gathers the ball won by Boutte again, but Notts County still have it across the edge of the six-yard box, and great save by Zadna. Second goal. Had to save it, but can only push it out, back out to the same Notts County player, who's Austin, and Austin gets the equaliser. 84 minutes gone, and we are definitely in for a game of football here. It's two goals each. Bajrami throws it to Ciso. Ciso gets it across the edge of the six yard block, out by Ellen, as far, only as far as Cameron. Cameron inside to Baldwin, Baldwin back to Cameron. Outside to Austin. Austin hits it against Rory Deacon. Not only falls as far as Cameron, and Cameron. Austin walks past Rory Deacon. He got. <laughs> he had Patterson in behind him, and very much as Dagenham and Redbridge scored. But uh, Austin didn't cross, he just cut back onto his right foot and put a powder puff shot in that wasn't troubling anybody. And he'll steal another yard or two. Deacon with the throw. Two people fall over and uh, the linesman are judges that it's the Maidstone player at fault and it will be a Knox County throw. Referee runs in, blowing his whistle. I don't think there was any too, too much sort of no. like... Um, just both going for the ball and both fell over. Too, too, too much grit or grime in that. Um, I think it was... Uh, but the, the referee, I suppose, made sure. Anyway, ball is with Rawlinson inside to Baldwin. It's a long, long ball forward. And that will be a penalty shootout. Yep. There that you seven go. minutes actually went quite quickly, didn't it? Yeah, it did. Of course, this is our third penalty shootout that we've commentated on. You and I. Yeah. And uh, well, a record of one win, one loss. Going yeah. back to that one against Billericay. Tom Hatter was the hero that day, wasn't he? Absolutely. Saving uh, the final penalty. Well, we'll just have a little bit of organisation whilst, uh, uh, they, uh, um, whilst, whilst they decide who's taking and all the rest of it. I mean, my, my, my thread throughout was anything can happen. Um, and hopefully you stayed with us on Stone's Life, you know, managed to, to, to get hold of our commentary because we, we are now broadcasting. Uh, it's Booty versus Mayor again. Booty runs up, takes it and it hits it to the top of the goal. 1-0 to the Stones. And we've got Sam and he's uh, the uh, vocal. <laughs> yes, it is. Uh, who's uh, had a really good game. Uh, in fact, it would be my pick for the man of the match rather than Cameron. But Baldwin runs up and... Had the drive the wrong way, Baldwin scores. Oh, and this is, uh, looks like Dom Odesanya will take Maidstone's second penalty. One of the substitutes. Uh, he'd been on for a reasonable amount of time, so he should be getting into the game. Uh, a few boos because he took his time coming on. But uh, Dom Odesanya with the penalty runs up. Asanya checks and hits it straight down the middle. Mayor dives and that ball goes in, just for clarity. Yeah. So 2-1 to the Stones. Is this the other centre-back, Rawlinson? It, uh, it's, it most definitely is. Rawlinson, isn't it? 
It's very rare you see two centre backs taking the first two penalties. But anyway, Rawlinson versus Hadler runs up and hits it down the middle of the goal. Hadler dives, a bit like the last one. If he'd stood where he was, it would have hit him. But uh, as Big Jerome places the ball on the spot, all of the other players in a line um, along the halfway line in the centre circle. Ben and Williams, three paces, takes it and hits it into the goal. So that's Maidstone United three, Notts County two. And that is Jerome Ben and Williams scoring. Taps the. Uh, and uh, obviously he doesn't wish him good luck, but, uh, you know, all the best. And this is Mitchell, Mitchell versus Hadler. Mitchell runs up, takes it and scores, as you can hear from the cheer. So Cairo Mitchell. Unfortunately, any penalty shootout, somebody's going to miss. And it's Rory Deacon to take Maidstone United's fourth penalty. Runs up now. Rory Deacon takes it and hits it in the middle of the goal. And the person who misses is not going to be Rory Deacon today. It's interesting to note that every time that Mayers tried to save a penalty, he's gone to his right. And who's this for Notts County? This Number is eight. Austin. Is it? Yes, this is Austin. Yep, Austin, Austin runs up, takes it with his right foot, and again, Hadler dives the wrong way, and Austin scores four each. Again, typical hard work himself for the time he was on the pitch. And it's Patterson up against Mayer. Mayer jumping up and down, clapping his hands together. Patterson runs up and hits it into the corner right along the ground and Good uh, to be quite honest man they almost got there but it was um, very difficult for him and it was a real excellent penalty don't normally see them you say they're excellent when they hit along the ground but that was as close to the post as it could be if this doesn't go in then it's makes the united's game francis runs up takes it on his left foot and hits it in so five each Whereas Francis, if he missed it, first person to make a mistake and that's it. Anyway, for Wally, runs up, takes two paces and is saved. Leisman has his flag up. He didn't make him and take is it he again. saying that the, the, the keeper actually Come off advanced. his line. Is he going to make him take it again? You've got to keep your foot on the line and actually you look at the World Cup final. Anyway, for Wally, has another go now. But of course, there'll be a massive cheer if he misses again. But anyway... Josh for Wally takes it and scores it to the boos. You uh, look at the penalty shootout uh, in, the, in the World Cup final. 18 years, yeah, Matthew yeah, Palmer. Matthew yeah. Palmer um, coming to take the 12th penalty of the shootout. None have been missed yet. No, Matt Palmer takes it and saves, Hadler. Hadler saves it. I'm trying to say two words at once because Tom Hadler is the hero. Saving Hadler are coming out of my mouth at once and he does the aeroplane. He's got everyone chasing towards the Maidstone United fans who are going to be making very different comments to the same people making them at York. A few Maidstone players go over to shake the York hand, but uh, unfortunately there's um, something on the pitch the York steward deals with um, very, very quickly and let's hope that that's found and dealt with. But... Um, Maidstone United, let's not let that take away from Maidstone United. Tom Hadler making the save, and it's poor Matty Palmer who had a decent game, who, uh, not quite the villain for Notts County, but he's the unfortunate guy who doesn't make it. Anyway, just to reiterate, it is Maidstone United 6, Notts County 5 in a penalty shootout after a 2 all draw. Plenty of drama, plenty of action, and Notts County can, as they say, as the cliche goes, concentrate on the league.